As yeah. you know, we've got the drier air that's moved in behind yeah. the front. Some of you uh, probably got a decent amount of rainfall if you're especially in the northern half of the state. As this boundary came through yesterday, I know um, I am way overdue on getting the yard trimmed. So that's going to be uh, potentially in the future here as we got some dry weather that has returned. This frontal boundary is going to continue to sink to the south for today. That's going to clear everything out on the back side of that frontal system, which is why we started the day off with some clouds and now everything is starting to become more sunny and that's the case all throughout central Indiana on our camera network. I want to back out here just to show the uh, scope of all the blue skies we've had 76 right now in Fishers at 77 in Indy Bloomfield up to 78 right now and a very comfortable 76 in Greensburg. Well, we've still got a couple more hours here where that warming trend will continue to take place. Most of us see highs today right there near that 80 degree mark. We'll go 81 in Shelbyville 81 in Greencastle as well and Muncie you're high around 79. Here's the deal with Muncie. You were around 70 degrees early this morning. You dropped off into the 60s, but uh, really hasn't been much of a warming trend for you because this day has been so transitional. Once we get into the re remnants of the day today, you'll start to notice that cooling trend because of that mostly clear sky. We'll go 76 at 5 p.m. If you're headed to Guns N' Roses tonight at Lucas Oil Stadium, by the time the show starts at 74 degrees by 6 p.m. and then eventually we drop back through the 70s. Probably not going to need the jackets tonight as we get into the evening, but then certainly through the overnight, a little bit of a different story. Most of us are going to be in the 50s and at the bus stops in the morning, this might be jacket worthy for some. Uh, anything in the 50s, I certainly grab the sleeves at least. 57 overnight in uh, Shelbyville, we're in the upper 50s here in the Indy Metro. That's how we get the day started tomorrow, so we're starting off a little cooler. We're going to end up a little cooler as well. High is only forecast to be at 76, which still for this time of year, at this point in the season, we still have average highs in the lower 80s. So this is pretty well below average, but at least we've got another mostly sunny day on Thursday. 76 your high in Indy will go 75 in Lafayette, 77 from Bloomington over to Columbus and Bedford. We're going to keep this pleasant air mass going all the way through tomorrow evening and on Friday before things start to heat back up. So we've got another nice one. If you're headed up to Ruoff for the Jonas Brothers, they're in town tomorrow evening, 66 at 8 p.m. as the sun starts to set. Now this is borderline jacket worthy for me. By the end of that show, we're going to be bordering the upper 50s. So it will be a bit cooler there another morning in the 50s come Friday. Pleasant weather sticks around for the end of the week, but then quickly we're going to heat things back up. That cooler air mass retreats to the northeast and we've got heat that builds back in as we look ahead at the weekend. So going into Saturday and Sunday, getting much warmer. We're back in the mid 80s for highs, mostly sunny for the 54th Penrod Arts Fair. That's going to be going on from 9 o'clock in the morning until 5 p.m. And then for the Colts game potentially looking at the roof closed. I know it's going to be a sunny day, which is going to be nice, but it's going to be hot and <laughs> sunny with a high of 87. You're into the stand. You get into the sun. You know what I'm talking about. If you've been there, it's bright and it heats up quick. Uh, that could be a reason why we might see the roof and the window closed on Sunday, but we'll keep an eye on it. 87 on Sunday, pushing 90 by Monday into Tuesday. That's when our next front arrives. It brings our next best chance of rain Tuesday night and then slightly cooler on Wednesday behind that system.